Hello, Sarah Barton here at Angel Cuddle Cafe and Angel Cuddle Trails. I found a shady spot in the garden to make this video. It's very sunny and warm today. Which brings me to the topic of today's video tip. I wanted to share with you sunburn prevention and natural remedies using vegetables and fruit from your kitchen. Now prevention first is the best order I suppose. For prevention lemon juice is very good a lemon here just have all of my ingredients here lemon juice made into a lotion is very good for prevention of sunburn so you make a, a lotion with it and put that on before going out into the sun and Jumper wanted to join in. <laughs> um, as a remedy, I have a number of vegetables and um, things here. Uh, I'll start with potato. There you are, potato. Potato, um, raw potato juice is very soothing for the skin but if you have sunburn if you grate potato and mix it with um, olive oil then um, that is very soothing and curative for sunburn um, what else we've we got here we've got vinegar Vinegar, yeah, vinegar. Whoops, I nearly dropped the vinegar. If you sponge vinegar onto the skin, it has a very cooling effect. You know, when you get sunburn, you feel like you really are burning. It really, it, it soothes if you, um, oops. If you, I'm having problems today with the wind as well as the sun. I had to find a sunny spot where, <laughs> and also a non-windy spot, but it's still catching the tablecloth and blowing things about. Um, that relieves sunburn. Now, you may be surprised, or maybe you're not surprised, by egg egg yes egg well actually egg white if you um, put egg white in layers on your skin that helps to relieve the sunburn um, put on a layer let it dry and then put on the next layer um, do a few layers of egg white and on the sunburnt area and um, that relieves the sunburn. I also have here lettuce. If you um, boil the lettuce leaves and then strain the liquid off, Put it in the fridge for a number of hours to cool off and then use cotton wool balls to gently dab that liquid onto your sunburnt skin. And have I covered everything? No, I still have a tomato here. I have a tomato here. Now the tomato, I discovered, is really, really good for taking the soreness out of 
the sunburn. When I was in Tunisia, I fell asleep in the sun and I got really, really burnt. I couldn't sit down. It was so painful to do anything to walk. And the restaurant manager saw how bad my sunburn was and he had this huge plate of tomatoes delivered to my table. And I said to him, I didn't order tomatoes. He said, no, I ordered them for you. Go to your room, take the plate of tomatoes, go to your room, cut the tomatoes in half and gently rub the tomatoes on your sunburnt skin and it will start to relieve and soothe the sunburn straight away. Well, he was right. He was right and then that evening I could enjoy my meal without any difficulties. I was surprised. I hadn't heard of it before, but he was obviously used to um, showing the, uh, the tourists how to soothe their sunburn and I think that is all that I will share with you today there are some other natural remedies but that's enough to be going on with let me know if you use these um, people in the family have already got some sunburn this year that's what gave me the idea of sharing these remedies with you so I will leave you on that. Oh, well, I say let me know. You can contact me, as always, at Sarah with a H hyphen Barton.com. That's at Angel Cuddle Trails. You will find the contact page there. I love to hear from you. I say it all the time, but I really do love to hear from you. And if you would like me to look into any remedies or suggest any remedies for you, just ask me or share any remedies that you would like me to share with everyone else that you have found uh, very effective. That would be good. Maybe you have some other ideas for soothing or preventing sunburn. Well, on that note, I will leave you with the note of Jumper joining in again with me. <laughs> the video. Namaste, angel cuddles, bisou from the south of France, sunny Plenia. Bye bye for now. <laughs>